Uh, and then what about you? What's the good, the bad, and ugly? Well, you already asked me. You started off yeah. with me. Well, no, no, no. I, well, you didn't specify because you were kind of talking and answering Mike's mm -hmm. question. So tell us specifically, like, is the good, I guess, meeting people? Thruple? Yeah, the good thing is meeting people. My dating life has been really good. Um, okay. I've been with my boyfriend for over a year. And Okay, but it's an open relationship. No. He's but about to find out it is. The one he cheated on? <laughs> we do everything together. No, he was Can okay we get a whiteboard? With the other Can guys. we get a whiteboard? Okay. okay. With, with I need a boyfriend. Here, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Boyfriend, whoa, 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 whoa. thruple. Okay. Sugar other cane. boyfriend <laughs> broke up with a week ago, but, but this boyfriend, but a year. Well, she just yeah. said that. Both of them know. So your boyfriend, the guy, okay, the guy that you're in the thruple with, so I understand I this. The guy that you're in this, this polygamous relationship with, he's okay with you seeing sugar daddies. Yes. Okay, and that guy that you saw for that week was a sugar daddy. Well, we saw each other for like almost a month, but we like, did you like for buy a him week. a PlayStation or some shit? Like okay, that. so I'm it's just gonna be honest with you. It's you do realize good. that this guy that you're calling your boyfriend doesn't give a fuck about you, right? You know, yes, he does. And he's broke. Don't think of a guy. I know. I was girl. gonna say, do you guys co mingle fucker. money? Do you guys co mingle funds? He, he's broke. We he do doesn't everything have, together. He, he barely. So you have a joint bank account. Are you paying? You guys get money together. No, I'm not paying him. Okay. Like no, he's. Are you, paying, are you paying for stuff? But he has yeah. access to everything. Is the that good? Yes. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously, yes. It seems you ladies think um, that her guy not, is broke. It's not about. Is oh, it's not know. about money. Okay, I'm done. It's not about money. It's not about the sex. It's not the connection that we have. What, what does what does the the main guy do specifically? It's about getting well, real murky. I mean, now he's my manager, but he's he does marketing. He does a lot. He's your manager, girl. No, 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 no. Okay. So, but, so he's a pimp. so it's an open yeah, relationship, no, yeah. right? All right. No, but it, it's it, so he allows you to see sugar daddy men. Well, yeah, I mean, we did this all just happened in the last job, 15 days. You know? like, honestly, all you? of this is I'm 26, <laughs> okay. it just happened. Yeah. Everything that's been happening is just happened in the last 15 days okay. because we were just living like a regular boyfriend girlfriend relationship. Okay. So, the good is you got I, your thruple, is the bad, I guess, that y'all just gonna, gonna believe she's 26. Your 20s are for. Honestly, all yeah. the bad that happened to me was no. before I became a stripper well, and it should have, an OnlyFans yeah. girl. It'd be like I got like, I almost, like, my ex boyfriend was. <laughs> You're on the. Like, it was. Is he a that was just raw Don't talent. give us no, bad numbers. No, he was just a fucking marine. One guy fucked a boy at one. It was just marine. Raw talent? Did you say raw talent? The bad year you said was, um, like, just being in bad relationships? Yeah, like, honestly. And that was the ugly. And then what's the ugly with your because you're a dancer, right? So like, what what's the ugly? I mean, the ugly would just be the the come. Oh lord! We're gonna turn races here. Not she put the Indian gold last. No, 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 Ladies, ladies, guys, ladies. And there goes the other half of the yeah. chat. Uh, when I try to, you got because you guys got to remember that this is a podcast, this isn't like some normal conversation. So when you guys are all talking at the mic, it really hurts the quality of the show and what the audience can hear. So, all right. So y your guy is your manager, and, and he lets you have sugar life. daddies. Like I'm gonna okay. marry him. Like and how long have you guys? Forever. Huh? Fifteen days. Have the how long? <laughs> how long days? again? No. Fifteen been, days. How long again? Y'all been together? For a year, like okay, and a half. Okay. Okay. Do you I'm just going to be very it, candid with you. He doesn't care about you. If he lets you have yes, sex with other does. men, he doesn't care about I, I you. Add that. I want to add He's the only man that cares about me the most. Yeah, I want to add All the men of men. It's a man. Oh, it's so we never, could, if we love a girl, we'll never let a man have sex with her. We can have sex with other girls when we love someone. That's why threesomes are okay. But when you love a girl, we just can't. I mean, would you guys agree? How old is I could he? never I let a girl I love. Like, if, if it's a girl I'm fucking around with, I'll let her fuck my friends. I love him, and I'm still like, I have sex with other women. Yeah, but there's been girls I fucked around with that fuck my friends and stuff. If I love a girl, I'll never let her, like, I never let a man touch her. That's fact. I think, would you guys all agree with that? No, but the girls understand that the girls understand though that we can go fuck another girl. Yes, he's your them. manager. Can I ask you a question? Has he asked you to tattoo his name anywhere on the <laughs> front hemisphere of your body? Yes, he did. The smile <laughs> told everything. Why are you smiling? <laughs> No, he's your manager, and he has, okay, got it. Yeah. We're not judging. What? We're concerned because yeah. you are yeah. young and impressionable. Can I, can I give you it's some a fact. 
to be concerned like, about like this man. I love him. He loves me so much. Good. But I mean, can I honestly give you some advice? This is the best relationship I've Good. had in my life. That's awesome. In my day, we called it, but there's more to come. Communication is key, and we're like, oh, we're just like very okay, okay with a lot of things. That's fine. You can say that. But what I'm telling you is, 99% of men are not okay with their girl having sex with other men. It's true. If they care about her, they're probably just not confident in themselves. I'm I'm happy for okay, you. Okay, hold on. I don't know oh. about these people. I'm happy. I don't. For I'm you. happy. I'm happy for you. <laughs> You're happy you. for you. Let me ask you a question. You said Very he's well, not he confident. Shares. Those guys aren't confident in themselves. <laughs> Let me ask you this: Who's the more confident guy? The guy that stands up to you and tells you this mm-hmm. is behavior I will not accept. But if he you go met out, me. Let me finish my point. Me, Let me I'm finish. Sorry. Listen to the question sapphire. so you can properly respond. I'm telling you. Well, I'm asking you. Who's more confident? The man that puts boundaries on you and tells you that this is unacceptable if you have sex with other men. Or the guy that's indifferent to it and doesn't say anything because he's scared of what how you might react. I mean, he's not scared how I would react. I mean, he met me as a stripper. Mm-hmm. Um, he I was the ask one. You again, who's more confident? The person that puts boundaries, doesn't care what you say, or the person that doesn't put boundaries for fear of what you might respond? I mean, I would say, like, the one who has fear with who I, what I would respond or with what. Bro, like, you're Holy she's shit. young. No. Hey, be nice. I know. No. She's no. No. I'm not dumb. It, it, we it, all were I'm not dumb. Because like if times. I start talking to you in Spanish and you wouldn't understand, then you would be dumb. All right? Okay. We're speaking the English language. Okay, yes, but I, I'm. I don't claim to be bilingual. Okay, yeah, I'm bilingual. Spanish. I'm bilingual. So I'm like, no, I'm not stupid and I'm not dumb. Because if I started talking to you in any other fucking language, you would be dumb. So don't call me dumb. Are you saying? You, you can't asked, comprehend you know, the question. From the, from the beginning, you said to respect you, then I'm asking this in respect. I asked you the question two to three times and rephrased it multiple times, and you don't understand. 